next morning at the workshop, things are at fever pitch. Now they have all the parts they need, but that doesn't mean getting it together is going to be a walk in the park. We've got thousands of bits to put back together, and half of them, we don't know where they go. But do you know what, Jan? I'm going to leave that with you. Thank you, Gordon, sir. That's all There's right. a myriad of little jobs to do, but the big one is the same as it's always been. They need to get the heart back into this car. Come on then, PJ. The engine and gearbox has to be fitted into the subframe before the whole thing is put into the car. Take the strain. With the engine mounted ahead of the front wheels, it is a hell of a job to get the lump and all its ancillaries squeezed back home. Okay. Back. Hold on. Just need to get a few nuts and bolts and we can put it all together. Then we can put it in the car and we've got almost a complete Lancia. Hooray. With one day left, the clock's ticking and the list of things still to do is daunting. The seats need to be put in, the chrome work reattached, but the lad's biggest worry is still under the bonnet. It's almost as if there's missing a shim or something. We're going to have to go packing out the clutch cover. We haven't got time for this, seriously. We've, this got, is... to, we've got to do it. More open heart surgery on the Lancia. That's all that we can do. Right, so I know what I'm going to need. Let me go and find it. The engine works and so does the gearbox. The only trouble is that the clutch that sits between them doesn't. And no clutch means no car. When you push the clutch down there, it frees that up like that, look. That's free now and it's loose inside there, but unfortunately it's just not quite loose enough to change gear. And that's how fine-tuned cars are. I cannot tell you, I cannot put into words just how stressed everybody is here right now. Look at Fuzz's face, check Fuzz's face out. Everyone's in trouble. But after 35 years in the game, Fuzz has plenty of mechanical workarounds up his sleeve and he thinks he may have a bespoke solution. What, what I've had to do is make up some little spacers to put behind the clutch cover. Now, that's not exactly ideal, but it's got us out of trouble and it will be secure. So at last, we can get this car back together, get it finished and done. It's always a good sign when the hubcaps are going on. Will Fuzz's fix have worked? With just hours until they're due to reunite Derek with his beloved car, they'll have to hope so. Right, windscreen wipers, and that's me pretty much done, dude. OK, I'm just going to fit the grill. Final little piece of the jigsaw. Oh, let me have a look, let look me have a look. Look at that, look at that. Now, that is a beautiful-looking car, it isn't is. it? When we first started this, Fuzz, I would have said four out of ten. Yeah, I'm with you on that. Nine now. Easily nine. Heading for ten. Right, let's give it back. How are you with a tube of goulash <laughs> and also a sable brush? Goulash? Yeah. You're going to make him a stew? What do you mean? 